Hey guys, today we are going to be working on our license plate bracket. We added this uh, scooter rack on the back, but I don't know if you can see down below, but it kind of covers the license plate up. So we got on Amazon and we ordered this little bracket here. What we're going to do is we're going to mount the license plate right on here. And uh, I'm going to make a little plug in so I, when I take this off, I'll be able to unplug this and remove that tire, which shouldn't be very often. We ordered this on Amazon. We'll leave a link. Uh, but follow along. We're going to install this new license. We're going to relocate our license plate. All right, first thing we're gonna do is go ahead and lower this. I put these little straps on here, just as a double protection, you know, just in case you never know if it would come loose. Pull the pin out here. And we're able to lay our ramp for the electric scooters down. Now we're gonna uh, need to mark our bracket first, so. I'm gonna get a uh, an idea and get a marker here and we'll decide. So, got a little bit ahead of myself, but we can just stick this up here a minute and get an idea of what we're gonna need to do is mark where we're gonna locate the bracket on and then we can drill our holes. So, I'll go get a marker. All right, this has two little holes here where this mounts right to the tire rack. But we, what we're gonna do here is position this, kind of center it and above here so that it doesn't uh, hit the rack when we put it up and try to get it as straight as we can. And go ahead and make a mark. There we go, so that's all set. Now we can go ahead and lower our thing. Now we're gonna, right in the middle of that, uh, we're gonna put a hole somewhere right in here where our uh, brackets will come, come down. So I'm gonna say right in there and we'll have to drill a hole uh, big enough to get this through. So that's our next step. All right, we gotta remove this cover. This has like a little snap here below. It's fairly tight, so we can remove that. And then this, I think we can just slide it back behind and pull our cover off. There we go. So now you can see here we can actually mount our license plate on here. What we need to determine is where these wires will be coming through uh, and then we can run our bracket up to or our wire up around to the door hinge over here and then into place all right in order to get our power to our light on our license plate we have a hitch uh, wire where we can plug in here I figured this would be the easiest way so i made a little harness here and then we can just plug this right in here and we'll be able to get the power from our license plate light right up to it by just using this little little hitch. So now what we gotta do is just route it.
All right, guys, there you go. License plate's in. You can see the uh, nice LED light. I made a connection that if I have to take the tire off for any reason, it's got a little on plug, but I plugged that right in to this connection down in here. And that's like a trailer bracket, but all set. We've got our license plate up where if they stop us, they say, I can see your license plate. So, but you can see the license plate bracket. Hey, I hope this helped you out. If you ever want to put a rack on it and show you how to do it. Hey, if you enjoyed this, give us a thumbs up. Uh, hit the like button if you're not a subscriber I invite you to uh, hit the subscribe button and hit the bell if you want to be notified of our next video so thanks for watching we'll see you guys the next time if you'd like to support our channel we have links down below that you can click on uh, we have the we're an Amazon affiliate we have stickers available we have a, a t-shirt store where you can buy t-shirts and coffee chat mugs or if you just want to support us you can support us through the paypal link so we appreciate all your help thanks for watching we'll see you next time